Hi, this is Dr. Sushma, Consultant Colorectal Surgeon. Today, I am going to tell you a few home remedies for fissure nano. First important thing is to consume diet rich in fiber. And adequate hydration is also very important. See that you take 4 to 5 liters of water and you consume good amount of fluids. And next thing is physical activity. Physical activity stimulates your bowel so that you don't get constipated easily. And next most important thing is SIDS bath. Now I am going to explain you in detail how to do SIDS bath, how many times you are supposed to do that and how long you are supposed to do that. And all these will be explained in detail now. What is SIDS bath? SIDS bath is nothing but immersing your perianal area in lukewarm water. That is nothing but you take a plastic tub take lukewarm water and add few drops of Dettol or few drops of Betaren and immerse your, your perianal area in that. So you are supposed to do the SIDS bath minimum 4 times a day and each session should last 15 to 20 minutes. So how long sh uh, you should continue this? So fissure healing time generally it is 4 to 6 weeks. So you should continue doing SIDS bath until your fissure heals. So the mechanism of action of SIDS bath is the temperature of the water which is slightly more than lukewarm, it relaxes your muscle, increases the blood supply, thereby your fissure heals faster. Most frequently asked question regarding SIDS bath is, should I add some salt or some other chemical in that? Never add any salt or some kind of uh, other chemicals because those irritate your perianal region. Next important advice is as most of the fissure patients are constipated so you are not supposed to strain while passing stool and never try to evacuate your stool digitally and never postpone your bowel movement. Once you try to postpone your bowel movement your stool stays in your, in your rectum for longer time and more amount of water is absorbed and your stool becomes hard. In spite of following all these measures if your pain doesn't subside or your fissure doesn't heal Meet a colorectal surgeon, get evaluated and treated.